Hello and welcome to the Final Bets 2014, 2014 The Game, Game Awards slash PlayStation, PlayStation Experience Combo Exhibition Match Results Show. I'm Kyle Wassman. I'm Michael Huber. We placed some bets last week, late last week, about what would happen at the Game Awards. Mm -hmm. The key And the PlayStation Experience. And the PlayStation Experience. The combo. The combo. It's a great weekend. What a weekend! It was almost E3. It was borderline E3. E3 for Christmas is what yeah. that was. I had a chance to go to PlayStation Experience. Wasn't at the Game Awards, but PlayStation Experience felt like E3. Whoa. Production value. What are you doing, what are you doing smelled, rubbing your hand? Production it value. smelled like money. <laughs> Walking <laughs> up and down those aisles. Well, you had to pay to go there. Yeah. I mean, like, your money just went directly into those things. 50 bucks. Was that worth it? Absolutely. Cool. Okay. You want to talk about our bets? Let's do it. All right. Are we, are we starting off hot? Who will win Game of the Year? Yeah, we started off hot. We, we went straight to the big one. All right. At the Game Awards, who would win Game of the Year? Who will win Game of the Year? I, for whatever reason, probably Ben Moore, <laughs> said Bayonetta 2. That's not, no, no, no. Bayonetta 2, I think, still has the highest Metacritic score amongst those games. It wasn't irrational to vote for Bayonetta 2. However, what's the guy's name? Lou from the Associated Press? Yeah. Said, if Bayonetta 2 wins, I'm just going to quit. Yeah, what? What? Yeah. So, Huber, if you won that bet, that? you also would have had Lou from the Associated Press quit. <laughs> the world I don't know that would have been. That's about. I bet Dark Souls 2. I think. I don't know why I did that. I think I thought everybody like lo loves this game. This is still a great mm -hmm. game. I think it's seen as a lesser sequel. Riding I think, into reason. the Bloodborne hype, maybe? Yeah, so the game that won was Dragon Age Inquisition. That's Game of the Year, according to the Game Awards. According Not to a bad games. pick. That's still a good yeah. pick for a game. Yeah. It's uh, a huge game. Yes. Our zero, time. zero, though. No points. No points for All anyone. Right. Next bet was, how many new game announcements will there be at the Game Awards? Because leading up, lots of exclusives. Yeah. Promised. A lot of Keeley hype. A lot of Keeley hype. We're going to have dozens of exclusive announcements. Well, he never said dozens, but he said over a dozen. He said like 15 or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, so we bet how many of those would be game announcements. And we should make it clear, Huber and I, this time for the first time, we voted at the same time. Yeah, love this. Love this. This is a staple now. This was great. And we did three, two, one, go. Uh, we both bet four. We were close. The result was three. Uh, those games including Tacoma, which looks pretty cool. Space Bioshock. Uh, Banner Saga 2, and that new game, we counted this one, uh, what's his name? Faber? Joseph Faber from mm -hmm. Haze Light. EA's like, hey, we have an indie studio. Yeah. Here's a shot of two guys on a train. Looks cool. Set the tone. Set the that mood. Set a tone? Said nothing. Showed nothing gameplay-wise. Don't know what's happening. Two guys on a train, though. I like I like the vibe. Wow. Yeah. They could be going, going on cross-country. They could be stowaways. The whole game could be on this train. It could be some, uh, like, Hateful Eight Quentin Tarantino thing where the entire game is just in that one train car and they're talking to each other. It could also be, it could be none of those things. I don't know. But, but it got my mind racing with possibilities, which I respect. Huber, that's why you're an asset to this team. <laughs> I'm so glad that you're at least hopeful about that, whereas yeah. I'm just like, they shouldn't even show it. You're right, they should have shown that. You're right. Um, so we got really close. That was, well, it was close. But yeah, so uh, it was three. Point for each. We, I'll take a point for that. One point. off? Yeah, we get a point. We get a point? We didn't get it right? Yeah, but we were both closest. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Gotcha. Cool. One point Huber, one point Bossman. All right. Next, who will win best online experience? I think we were taking the piss with this one. <laughs> I'll, I'll, you know, I'll just be honest. I think I said, Huber, let's find the dumbest category and vote on that one. Yeah. Best online experience. That means nothing. What kind of category is that? Saw the word experience? Yep. It's in your wheelhouse. Yeah. Uh, and so we both voted for Destiny. And yeah. we were both right. Yeah. <laughs> What's funny, though, if you go back and watch it, I'm like, I know this one. And you're like, ah, I don't know. Uh, and we both said Destiny. Yeah. And Destiny won. That's, I don't know. I was leaning towards Call of Duty. Really? Yeah. That's not an online experience, though. Yeah. You can see why. I can see why they gave it to Destiny. It wasn't a wrong choice. Mm -hmm. uh, then it was how many deaths? Uh, how many deaths will we see in Metal Gear Online? Regrets. It was promised leading into it 
Metal Gear Online will debut at the Game Awards. This was huge, actually. This was a really, really great trailer yeah. that we got to see. Uh, Hubert, do you know what you bet? I bet seven. I bet nine. The that, result. That mech suit. Eleven deaths. That one, like, the whole time I'm watching this yeah. in Ian and Omar's room, we're with yeah. Elise, we're all crowding around this. We're talking about deaths. Ian just has my back the whole way. He was like, oh, no, he's not, you know, he's not dead. Oh, he yeah, can yeah. be alive. Yeah. The whole way through, I'm like, it's over. It's over. He's like, no, 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 no. The second he gets in that mech suit. It's like a tiny Metal Gear. Yeah. Just start shooting. <laughs> Racking All right, up the over. deaths. Yeah. Racking them up. Yeah. 11 deaths. Hopeless at that point. That's three points, Team Bossman. Two points, Team Huber. <sighs> I just wanted that. Stealth infiltration. You had that. That's the first half of the trailer. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. They 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 did the best of everything. Yeah, that's true. Should just erupt it at the end, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're actually in the old Metal Gear Online. There's nothing like that. That was basically like a Call of Duty perk. That yeah. was like an airstrike. Yeah. Watch out. Watch out for those. We'll see. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, they've, been, they've been showing a lot of uh, of Metal Gear like that. All, I feel like all the all the gameplays are. It starts off stealth, mm -hmm. and then the shit hits the fan. Okay. And then they escape or get out of there. And Slow down time life. and things. Yeah, yeah, get in the car, drive off a cliff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, that's big boss style. This Should've isn't known. Solid Snake. Big boss does it big. <laughs> that is true. Good point. Uh, oh, final bet. That's on you. How many games will be announced as Morpheus compatible? Yes. Old, meaning old games, as long as they say, hey, by the way, this is for Morpheus yeah. now. That's cool. That counts. I guaranteed No Man's Sky. You guaranteed it. I guaranteed it. And <laughs> no. What'd you bet? I bet five games, which was a conservative bet. I wanted to bet more. Yeah, I remember even after that, you're like, they're going to go big. Yeah. You go indies. You were, mm -hmm. you were so excited that you had everything above five. Yeah. Because I bet three. Mm -hmm. I was so confident in that bet. And they... They didn't do a lot of Morpheus. No. They didn't do a lot of new Morpheus. Which makes me concerned. It makes me think it's uh, 2016, really. Yeah, yeah, probably. Long way off. Uh, so no there, Man's Sky, long way off. There were two new games. Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes was announced for Morpheus. Mm -hmm. And The Forest, Morpheus compatible. Yeah. That's it, two. I did my due diligence on that one. I did a lot of research. I tried to find anything. Yeah, I, I had too. pretty much given up. You wanted to lose this bet, it felt like. You were like, no, we can find more. We can find more. I, I dug. Was, That's oh. it. The, the two official ones. When I walked over to the Morpheus section and it was all the demos that were already at E3, yeah. I knew it was hopeless. Yeah, the forest honestly barely an announcement. I'm not even positive yeah. about that one, but we're counting it. I mean, it's uh, obvious. So that's two. My, when, my bet was three. Huber, I did, I did pretty well on this one. Yeah. I got four points out of our five bets. Yep. However, we always do final bets for extra points. These are our craziest bets. We go out there with these. Uh, Huber always does something stupid. I always do something really smart. Uh, this time, I bet that we would see The Last Guardian. Uh, when they opened with Uncharted 4, yeah. my mind immediately said, Last Guardian is closing the show. Yeah. Done. Yeah. Last Guardian is the finale. Or God of War. One or the other. So here's how my emotions went. Okay, first Final Fantasy VII. Let's, oh my God. We're yeah, never yeah. speaking of that again. But Sean Layden comes out after that and says, okay, everybody, I, I, I know that was big, uh, but we have two more games. And I think at that moment, I knew Last Guardian is not one of these two games. <sighs> Yeah, because you don't say, oh, two more games. You just come out of nowhere. Yeah. Unannounced. Yeah. <laughs> and so, uh, then No Man's Sky. Mm -hmm. And it's like, I still have hope for Last Guardian at this point. Yeah. There's still hope in there. And then David F. and Jaffe walks <laughs> out. <laughs> you know what? I think that's why, that's why I have these feelings toward Drawn to Death. It's like, I can only see that game is not Last Guardian. <laughs> he doesn't deserve that. Poor David Jaffe does not deserve that yeah. on him. But man, that is what was in the place of The Last Guardian. Yeah. What did you bet? I bet Shenmue. Why? Because I believe. All right, Kyle? No one is going to kill my belief that we will see Shenmue HD or Shenmue 3 sometime in the future. Period. 
There's been too many rumblings in the surface. Too many, we hear you Shenmue fans. Don't give up Shenmue fans. We're working on it, HD collection here. You're saying just, it's only a matter of time. Cerny and, and Yu Suzuki having, <laughs> having hidden meetings. One of these days, I will not give up. I will never give up. The world will get Shenmue. I love the hidden meetings too, because they're not in natural places. The hidden meetings are underground. Yeah. This is a hidden meeting. Yeah, hidden meeting. <laughs> off the books. Off, off the, the books. radar. We have we have a GDC postmortem, Cerny and Suzuki. We have a we have a, <laughs> another one announced. They said there was going to be another one with them too. At GDC. They said, yeah, because they, they did one on Shenmue 1. Mm -mm. They said, stay yep. tuned for a Shenmue 2 uh, developer uh, postmortem. Okay. So, I mean, natural progression, you do that and you announce, all right, combo pack one and two or mm -hmm. three. Yep. You know what I'm imagining? I'm imagining Cerny, like, calling his assistant and saying, hello, Corey, I'm offline. Do not speak to me for the next hour and 45 minutes. Goes downstairs, gets into a car, yeah. bag over his head, yeah. drives to a secret location. Yeah. He's in, a, and he's in a, just a black room with Suzuki. Yeah, and he says, what do I need to do to make this happen? <laughs> and Yu says, my dream is too large for the PlayStation Yu Suzuki board. takes out a binder of a book mm -hmm. this big with ideas and, and locations and characters. And says, I need you to start working on the PlayStation 5. <laughs> And Cerny says, okay, for the you. The floor is not big enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I wish. Now I'm depressed. So, Huber, final score, four to two. Yeah. You got thwomped, dude. Yeah, I got thwomped. I would say your performance was something close to pathetic. So to anyone who doesn't regularly watch these specials and is wondering what's happening here, this is the Slusser Cup. I didn't win the Slusser Cup. This was simply an exhibition match. Uh, if you do win a regular final bets, you get to keep this, and that belongs to you. And so that belongs to Huber currently. However, Say that one more time. That belongs to Huber currently. Cool. However, That's all. Huber, you did lose this exhibition match. Oh, I did. And there were stakes on the line. If Huber was to lose this exhibition match, he would be forced yeah. to wear a single shirt for an entire week of videos and end each video with a slogan on the bottom of the shirt. Huber, are you excited to see the shirt? Oh, I've seen the shirt. You know what I noticed on it? It just makes this all the funnier to me. Um, there's like a little stain at the bottom of the belly mm -hmm. right here. Yeah, I mean, I just went to Goodwill to get this shirt. You have to wear this gross, <laughs> like, grease-stained shirt for a week. <laughs> oh. <laughs> just says, this is like Goodwill. Yeah, this is this so is a Goodwill somebody purchase. owned this before. Oh, absolutely. This is me carrying... Somebody, humor, a person in this world saw this shirt and said, Guitars, now that's living. I can relate to that. And then they yeah. regretted it <laughs> by giving it to Goodwill. Yeah. Ugh. Uh, why don't you, I mean, it starts now, Huber. Why don't you put this well, on and sign us off? Right now, I, I thought, you know, I didn't want to cheapen it. I was going to give you the entire week. You know, it's already Tuesday. The week begins now. So Tuesday to Tuesday. And then, yeah, at this point next Tuesday, you can now, you can then stop take, wearing that shirt. Okay. Just so you know, stand up. It's not dead. It is never going to happen, it though. It will happen. Don't you see? The and momentum so is you know, mine now. I'm never losing just again. Just so you know, you know with this shirt, when a bet is lost, the previous stakes are raised. Next stand-up, it's going to be even more intense. I'm going to have you go out in the street and All do something. All I hear is jabber, jabber, jabber from a person who can't win a simple exhibition match. Where'd your little grease stain come from? <laughs> Probably like fries or something. <laughs> uh, everyone, we're not doing final bets again until E3, unless another crazy thing pops something up crazy like this will did. Happen, yeah. uh, but Microsoft will uh, follow suit and do some crazy. Yeah. Oh, well, we want to, you know, have our own. We don't want to be left out of the party. Huber, I gotta say, this shirt really works for you. You're explaining you. these things to me, and I'm like, man, that's a good fit. <laughs> Guitars. 
Live to play. Play to live. 